And the most straightforward bit of rigging you're going to do is part of the level one rope axis course. It's going to be a basic anchor system. So for that we're going to have one nice big solid strong anchor point, minimum of 15 kilonewtons. We're going to take our anchor slings directly onto there together and we're going to have two lines hanging straight down below the anchor. The first thing is going to be to attach your anchor slings to the anchor point. And have two of those, two carabiners. Best practice would be to try and keep those carabiners upside down so once they're screwed up, you shouldn't rattle away open with gravity and back to back as well. So the weakest portion of the carabiner, which is the gate, is on opposite sides of the two carabiners there. Now, I'm going to take some rope. Now, here I have a 25 meter rope. Whenever you're rigging ropes, make sure that the end of your rope is tagged. The tag should let you know when it was put into service, the length of the rope and the type of the rope as well. Now if you only have a tag on one end, it might mean that that rope's been cut down. And you might want to actually have a, a 50 meter rope if it only says 50 meter on one end. So just make sure both ends are clearly tagged. Then what we're going to do is start by finding the centre of the rope. So we're going to pull that rope through your hand. Just inspecting the rope as you go. Looking and feeling for anything unusual in the rope. get to the end, you'll have a loop and that should be roughly the centre point of the rope. Now for this basic anchor system we're going to work from the centre point and just to mark it to make it a little bit easier, you don't have to do this, we're going to tie an overhand knot. So nice small overhand in the centre, now you can come back to that, you know where the middle is and you can work from each side. Now we're going to take one side, make a bite of rope, I'm going to do a figure of eight or nine. I'm going to use nines for this, but eights would be fine as well. Generally speaking, I'll try and keep the loops reasonably small and rigging the ropes. You should get close to the anchor point of stuff when you do climb up there. There's one figure nine giving us one line to work with. I'm going to do the same now on the opposite side. knots into one carabiner first, screw it up, and we're going to take the other carabiner and pass it through both of those loops. What that does is it shares the load 50-50 on the carabiners and it also backs the system up. Now we're going to finish off every bit of rigging that we do with stopper knots. So find your tails. Remember stopper knots should be at least 30 centimetres or so from the end of the rope. So take a little bit more than that. Stop or not, same on the other leg. That's a basic anchor system.